Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. For today's video I bought a Sega Master System 2. Not because I need it, but because of its condition. Let's unboxing and see what's inside. And there she is. Just look at this fantastic paint job. I don't know how many layers of paint it has, but for sure, many. I don't know what else to say about it, so without further ado, sit down, relax, enjoy me while I take care of this little machine. Stick around. First, of course, let's disassemble all the parts from the console and from the controller. Let's go. And with all done, it's time to start removing these many layers of paint. After a good 20 minutes, I managed to remove the paint from the cartridge cover. And after almost 2 hours of sanding, I managed to remove almost all the paint from the console too. Sprays a bunch of trash to the paint. And also, the bottom part kind of reacts in some spots, bubbling the paint. So I decided to remove the paint and start over again. And then came out the second drama. I used a paint remover to get rid of the paint faster, and after a couple minutes, it started reacting with the plastic and caused this completely mess and kind of melt the plastic. I stopped in time, but other pieces were affected. The bottom part of the controller is okay. The top case suffered a little damage, but looks okay after the sanding. But the top part of the controller suffered hard bites. I will sand it a little more and try to recover it. For the bottom part, I have another one from a paint testing laying around, and I will give it a quick sand and use it to replace the damaged one. And after all the sanding process, we are ready for the paint take two. And finally, I get a pretty good paint job. I love this color. But before we spray the clear coat, this time I will apply the decals first. So let's sit down on the computer and make them really quick. And after print them, let's apply them on the new paint job. And 
finally, after spray two coats of clear, the paint job is finally done. And let me say it, it came out amazing. A couple small fails here and there, but overall, I simply love it. Now, while the clear coat still dry, let's give a quick clean. And of course, more drama. I broke the cartridge plastic cover. Fortunately, I have another one laying around. Not perfect, but will do for now. And finally, after all the drama, this project is done.
and this is it. A project full of dramas that finish with a really good result. The paint remover caused a few damage, especially on the controller, but without being perfect, the final result is really good. This paint is simply amazing. But enough dramas, let's plug it in and finally have some fun. And this is all for today. I hope you enjoy another project. If you want to see more, please consider subscribe, leave a like, comment and also share this video. As always, thanks for watching, see you in the next one.